As somebody that did not watch the Derby, probably not going to be somebody with a full lot of insight on this table, but I know there's a couple of people that did watch the Derby. Alex, did you watch it or not? No, because I just feel like there wasn't that many people that were exciting this year to watch. I know, I know, I know, huh? I know Alonzo went back to back, but. Woo! Looking at the names, I can agree with you. Like, say, like Trey Mancini, Matt Olson, you know, people that. It's just the like, name people recognition. Like, people that hit home runs in, like, the regular season, but you don't see them as, like, perennial, yeah. you know, big games in a home run derby. But I will tell you, as I talked about with Adam before the show, Mancini just lit it up last night. So did Trevor Story. Yeah. Those, were, those were fantastic matchups. I mean, they didn't face each other. Well, actually, they did face each other in the, in the semis. But. Otani was in there, right? Yeah, Otani, Otani was, he, he got in the first round of the semis. Show, yeah. Shohei, I, I, I think the moment got too big for him. He was, I, I think he kind of chilled. Yeah. Especially when it got to where he tied, he tied with Soto. So they went into a second, a second like a, a sudden death thing. Yeah, they, they tied in a sudden death, and then they went to a like a sudden sudden death where they each got three swings, and so Soto went first. Bombed all three of them. Went three for three, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Just crushed the bomb. Just crushed Show, the bomb. Shohei's very supposed to swing. He hit like a ground out. Yeah. Right to the first base. <laughs> <Wow>. yeah. <laughs> he like topped it right to like the pitcher's screen pretty much. But to be fair, I mean the dude's actually a, he's a pitcher. Oh, he but, he, he's also, yeah. but he's also, <laughs> yeah. and he also yeah. 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 leads the MLB in home runs. Yeah. yeah. So it was mad respect. You guys have 33 home runs. You, can, you, can, hold, you can hold your head high being eliminated in the first round home run derby he's because still, you're a pitcher. He's still at 28. Yeah. yeah. So, yeah, he hit 28 bucks. He hit 20. And, and this is from a guy who also started without getting a home run in like the first minute that he that he was hitting. He didn't hit a home run until like it was all, until he was under two minutes in the round. Oh, so then he was basically just perfect after that. Every pitch was once, so he got, he got so he, he got he got a little bit of a groove. Hit about like ten. Called his timeout with like a minute twenty to go till till the end. And then he, 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 he just started. Yeah, I mean, they were gone. Because so during that timeout, him and his hit his pitching coach, they can oh, communicate, right? They, they can communicate. Okay, they can communicate. But actually, um, from what I was hearing last night, the uh, pitching coach that or the guy that was throwing to Otani. Hasn't thrown BP to him since March of this year. Well, so he had, had, like, he had, had like taken no, a swing no, off of him. Okay. Yeah, yeah, so, the, so the, they didn't have like any. So there was a little bit of that sync up process. Right. right. Kind of like, okay, obviously he wants it in this There was no connection about right. how this speed gets. Yeah, right. Because yeah. yeah. like, from what I've heard, Shohei Otani actually doesn't take batting practice. No. Like, why would he? Yeah, I mean, he, he just like, no, I mean, no. just in general, like before games, he does not. No, so like, why would you? If I was him, I wouldn't. But I mean, if you're raising yeah, like that, hurt, no, I would. <laughs> but it, it, that's like, why a lot, of, a, lot of, a lot of players avoided the home run derby this year because people are starting to realize the size of like, it's it messing is. up your actual it's game swing. time swing. Yeah. 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 So they, uh, but like doing that, I guess, during the day warm up, he hit one 510 feet in warm ups. Yeah. yeah. Like bounced it off like the third day. I can do that. Yeah, five hundred ten feet, easy. <laughs> Especially in my life, yeah, you, you can get that. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah. I just, so, but either way, but I mean, you did have a Pete Alonso, who's the defending champ. Yeah, he went yeah, after that. Yeah. But it wasn't I mean, even fair in that first round. Oh, I mean, thirty-five in the first round. But then, I was going to say that, like, I think Sohei Otana just got screwed up by who he faced in the first round. Anybody well, other than Soto, he would have. I think he would have gone at least the second, maybe third round. I don't know. Well, I don't. Perez hit well, twenty eight. You put him against Salvi. Salvi hit twenty eight. Yeah, like, like yeah. I said. But Salvi if he would have, he would have beat Trey Mancini. He would have beat Matt Olson. He would have beat Trevor Story well, and Joey Gallo. Well, you know, but actually, before they even made it to the the the, the second or the um, the sudden death part, he only had twenty two. Yeah. So I mean, Mancini hit. Oh, he had twenty four. He had twenty four. Uh, Story had like 24, 25. Salvi hit 20, 20, 28. So, so yeah, I mean, I mean if, yeah, you're like, before his extra one minute in time, I just think, uh, yeah, I, I he just, technically would have, he technically would have lost right. to the majority of the first round. Because the majority of that first round was 20, 23, plus, 24, yeah. I think, like I said, 25, I think, went to Trevor Story, maybe. Yeah, I think Story had 20, because I think, because on, yeah, on that, uh, Excuse me. On that right side, the difference between each person was only one home run. Yeah. It was like 24, 23, and like 25 to 24. So, what if they did the home run derby after spring training and before the season started? Or after the season alone? I think you have to do it after the season. I think you have to do it after the season. I, I, think, I, think, I think post spring training, like, but preseason, like in that little weird middle gap. Yeah. The home run here hasn't really gotten into the groove yet, yeah. so you kind of be an unfair advantage. But what but I think postseason would be perfect. But you say postseason, are you saying uh, even after the, like after the World Series and all, 
or like before actual. I kind of want to do it before playoff baseball, kind of like how the NFL does the Pro Bowl. Yeah, yeah, that's what I'm thinking there too. Okay. I mean, it, I, would, be, yeah. I just think it would be really cool to see like the, the top home run hitters, like one through eight. You know, it, it doesn't need to after the whole season. After the whole season, yeah. I mean, because it's. It is kind of that thing where they've gotten to the point where people are realizing it is messing up their swing in the middle of the season yeah. and they don't want to do that anymore. Because you're going to have some names. I mean, you know, uh, Sally Perez, Kansas City's not making the postseason. Uh, Matt Olson, well, uh, Ace, Ace 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 shot. Texas Rangers, definitely not making the postseason. Colorado Rockies, definitely not making the postseason, right? Like, you got some of these guys that, you know, after the season, they'd be more than happy to do the home run derby. Right. Yeah, and there's probably some bigger names too. Like if had Acuna not blown out his knee and Atlanta not made the postseason, he could do the home run derby. Yeah, right? especially yeah. with two million dollars yeah. on the line. Yeah. So you know, I just think for baseball, I mean, there's, they're, they're going to have to figure out a way to get the big names into this, or this is going to kind of lose some of mm. This was a great one because there was a shit ton of homers. Right. Oh yeah. But you, 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 you also credit that when we were, I don't know, we were hanging out when you were kind of like just keeping track on your phone. It was the stadium too, also. Absolutely, that. Uh, Colorado. I mean, everybody's dropping yeah. thirty miles. You don't know that high altitude. We, the average the wind blowing the right way. It was like an extra twenty feet per homer. Yeah. In in on average, on average yeah. in Colorado. Yeah. I mean, if yeah. we, if it's that it's that thin altitude, and especially if the wind's blowing the right way. That ball. So basically, it's good to two hundred feet up in the air. Yeah. yeah. So I mean, we take this thing to lift and it's going. We yeah. take this thing to Seattle, and the best numbers out the first round are going to be eleven or twelve homers. Take this shit to Miami with that damn center yeah. field little weird they thing they got. Uh, it's, it's gone. gone. Yeah, pitching yeah. it down. They, they, know, still, they still got like that weird death corner, don't they? They still, yeah. yeah they, 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 have they still have that weird death corner, corner. Yeah. Where it goes yeah. like 410 and then. No, I'm not, I'm not talking about the weird statue. I'm talking about that death corner they got in yeah. center field. <laughs> yeah, and I mean, it, I mean. Yeah. But also being in Miami at sea level with all the humidity, I don't really care. Right. Like I'm, but I'm also like that. Which is a massive part, too. Yeah. I've always liked it, though, at even. I've liked it at San Fran Stadium. Oh, so your friends are playing with yeah. the river, yeah. the, the cove, and all that. They, yeah. they, they hit over there. Yeah. Yeah. That's always been a fun one. To you got all the kayakers out there paddling around. Yeah, yeah. 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 So that's yeah. always been a fun one to watch. It might not be like you're saying. You might get 18 as like a top number 20, but it's still. But a well, good, it's still. But you also think about like it's, it's a short portion right there too. Yeah. So, I mean, if, if you got full hitters, they're yeah. gonna. And I feel like we had a lot of left-handed power hitters this year. The righties are actually the ones that dominated this. The left, the lefties had a lot of trouble. Yeah, well, I mean, Story, Mancini, and Alonzo, all right-handed hitters, all made it to the second round. Soto was a lefty, made it. Um, but uh, say, but Gallo's uh, a lefty, Shohei's a lefty. And Soto's a lefty. Yeah. The rest of them are all right-handed. Yeah. So, I mean, but I still feel like you had a lot, of, yeah, I guess for, what is it? One eight, out of eight the, people. Eight, yeah. yeah, half the field was lefties, though? No, only three of them were. Three of the eight. eight. Three of the eight. And then one of the four. That's, I mean, just, just under. Yeah. Semi, yeah. yeah, and only one of four in the semi, so. I, you know, Tori, uh, give Story credit though. I mean, he, you know, at, oh, his, home park, out there and good. at his home park should have had a little advantage, but it, it's weird, like, to say that Pete Alonso's, you know, back to back champions because there wasn't a home run derby in 2020. So, you know, for as long ago as it feels in 2019, it just, you know, didn't carry the same, wow, he did it again, you know, the yeah. back to back kind of thing. But, right. but I, mean, I mean, he's got some pop though. He's, he's got so he, much pop. And, he's, you know, he's a how bad. He's a monster he, bad yes. now. He's, Certainly gonna have a shot. At he's him. got he's got enough to where I believe that there was a twenty twenty one. He if he wasn't the winner, I think he'd have been in the finals. Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah. I mean, he would have been he, a, he would have been one of the last two guys. Twenty twenty one. Yeah. When yeah, you yeah, drop yeah. thirty, yeah. Hey, go ahead again. No. You're this in ball, Colorado. This, this ball pack, and yeah, this ball pack helped, but yeah, even before his like where, break, he where, was at like twenty four. Where was it supposed to be in twenty twenty? The All Star game. Uh, the whole was it, was it Cleveland last year? I think it was supposed to be in Cleveland. I think it was Cleveland last year. Yeah. Yeah. And that also just brings me to the tangent of it should have been in Atlanta this yeah, year. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But we're not going to get into all that so, nonsense. Yeah, but, you know, as you were saying earlier with having big names in the Derby, if it had been in Atlanta, I think you would have seen Acuna in the home run. Derby. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's seen, the hometown hero. Yeah. You would have seen yeah. possibly even Freddie Freeman in the home run Derby yeah, it, yeah. It, to go up against each other potentially in the finals. Then, they wouldn't obviously put them on the same side. Yeah, but, I mean, yeah. you could have you could have seen them both go up against each other. Like, if you if you had to pick like your top names though, who would you have had in this like? Well, Shohei's got to be in there. Um, I would, I would have loved to have Okuna in there if he had not. Um, blown tor- his blown, yeah. yeah, you know, R- 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 the right ACL. Yeah. But also, if it wouldn't have messed up his numbers, swing right. Acuna in there would have been it's, it's what, so exciting. But like, what about Tatis? Is Tatis need to be in yeah, there? Tatis, Tatis, Tatis should be in there. there. Uh, you know, he doesn't probably deserve it as far as the stat-wise, but Bryce Harper would draw a crowd. 
I mean, right from just, yeah, yeah, yeah. just from the damn, just the um, name recognition. You know, you want to see a, a Stanton, you want to see a Judge, you know, somebody from one of those two uh, yeah, squads. Would be a good one. Honestly, Robbie Devers deserves to be a name. Devers, dude, Devers. Devers dropping yeah. bombs for Boston. Sander uh, Bogart dropped bombs, too. Yeah, but... Well, uh, Devers well, is the bigger name, though, yeah. for that. Max Muncie, or... Heck, yeah. Cody Ballinger. I mean, Cody yeah. Ballinger's got a sweet swing, so... Except for this year. Yeah, so with his <laughs> 200 average. Suck at Dodgers. But, but I mean, uh, yeah, I, I see what you're saying. Like some of those, like those bigger. But Pete Alonso's one to have you, is a good one to have. Yeah, he's, Shohei there's definitely. Wrong, you know. Honestly, there's nothing wrong with Pete Alonso. There's nothing wrong with Soto. He's starting to make his own name along there with Acuna. There's nothing wrong with Joey Gallo. Joey, Joey Gallo's been dropping Joey Gallo, bombs. Yeah, Joey Gallo's a guy that hits 45 homers a year and he bats 200. He strikes out 300 times, but drops drop bombs. bombs. I mean, but yeah, tra- tra- straight tra- out see we're home. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, Trey Mancini right That's now. Has been an you know an absolute raise tip. raise 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 oh, raise, raise, raise 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 yeah, raise but then look we got the raise up there the raise up there there's two raise okay so that that is all the coaches just sitting yeah. up front yeah, yeah, that's, that's, that's all coaches yeah okay yeah 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 but I mean like so, you had Mancini who's been going on the tear this year you have I mean I, it's a cool story for Mancini coming off of cancer too yeah stage yeah. three colon cancer yeah. yeah like that's a, that's just an awesome story. So, so, I mean, I think I think they put the white people in this year. But they put that one to be in there. Yeah, but I also think, like you're saying, they are bigger names that are going to be the future faces of MLB. That, that should sh- want to be in there, and yes. MLB should want them to be in there to draw that crowd. Could. So.